Asurut kas it and asah nam das si vechiat nach. Hasur tai tai veche nerten teyana. Nasur tam sur tam tayar vishon. Ta si vit nach santur tur tan ve eche. Tam teyene yen ton uktan tachna. Tan asur vishiat nam tayena ya. Nasivia <laughs> In dono yon de bena in dai Isorenam da khan in de bena Ichtorenam nicht den de yon do ho Nishende ben toram dam bai Isanach nin dono Das 
Hassuch, das sind nur... Hassuch, dann sie die Schände nach nach Schänach nantei. Und ach, so nach nach schick nach weh. Das so, dann mach so, dass sie weh. Hast du, na, schön, na, je, ne, und do. Dann, 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 ich schön, dann, dach, nie, wie schon. Satnam, thank you so much for joining. My name is Jean and I am a channel for Creator Consciousness to assist humanity in ultimately reawakening and re-embodying to its divine, core, authentic expression, which I believe to be the Christ in inner child. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> so yeah, Satnam, thank you so much for joining. Thank you so much for connecting with me. <sighs> Today's activation slash blessing um, it's all about calling in the angelic frequencies for assistance and guidance and healing and just niceness, I guess. Um, as I as I started channeling the frequencies, as I started with the with the light language, um, I very clearly like heard, um, or I, I rather I understood. I didn't hear this time. I I I just understood how like these armies of angelic beings all of a sudden just like readied themselves at my side, you know? <laughs> um, which was really profound for me, it was beautiful. Um, it feels very soft and very gentle and very caring, but very powerful and very like direct and to the point, if that makes sense. So yeah, that is what I'm sharing today. That is what I am gifting today. It's this this connection with the angelic realms. Um, it's it's receiving assistance from the angelic realms, which is extremely high vibrational. It's all about love. It's all about light. It is very light as well. Um, I'm seeing a lot of like very light blue. I'm seeing pink. I just saw a butterfly. <laughs> just lovely, lovely energies. Truly, truly to connect with and bask in. Um, just, just to be clear though, like I, I've, I've met like angelic beings, right? And they, um, only, only at, at the start of my journey did the angelic beings seem angelic to me. Um, much, much later in my journey, up until now, um, I experienced angelic beings and the uh, ETs um, very differently. They're not, um, I mean, they're very light, there's a lot of light and I feel a lot of love and stuff, but um, when I, when I look at them, deeply when I like focus in on on the beings they actually look kind of scary they look kind of like um there's this one entity this one entity um angelic entity that I that I met um I was I was c connecting with this being and um it all seemed very like otherworldly right but the more I started focusing, like actually focusing on the being, the more I started seeing that this being looks like, um, like psychedelic locusts, if that makes sense. It looks like um, a swarm of locusts. And that is what this, this, this angelic being looks like. And, um, you know, when I noticed that first, I was kind of a little bit taken aback, but then it all started making a lot of sense to me. First of all, in regards to how these entities operate, um, as I've worked with angelic frequencies, I've noticed that they don't really have, I mean, yes, they're very loving and they're very, um, 
caring and compassionate or whatever but they can be very cold as well cold in a sense of they are simply doing the will of the divine and whatever kind of um gets in the way of that is just in the way of that and there's no like compromise to that um in regards to the like locus i i actually experienced this entity as eating up um densities like that's what it explained to me that's what it it, it, it showed to me like it's like like be not afraid but like i eat the bullshit you know like it comes and it like comes into your being and it feels really intense and it feels like you're being devoured but it's because you are your 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 densities are being devoured your um evilness your darkness your you know that's how this being explained it to me anyway so um however you experience the angelic realms do know that it is love do know that it is light and it is compassion from creator however you experience the angelic realms this is intended to assist you in connecting with the angelic realms and connecting with their assistance and their guidance and their power and their healing um, I just felt the need to give like a, a little bit more of a like grounded and realistic explanation on the angelic realms. Um, even the ETs, you know, like the aliens people connect with. I've met ET beings that looked beautiful and they did, they did look beautiful. But then the more you actually like look at them, you start to see that they're actually very strange looking creatures they're very strange looking um not at all what we would what we would describe as angelic or um beautiful or whatever um but there's like a beauty in that because as i saw that i saw the love of christ you know i saw how um and the love of creator and the grace of anyway <laughs> beautiful beautiful frequencies just be prepared and be aware of the the strangeness of it all so yeah, Satnam, thank you so much for joining. Thank you for connecting. I love you. I'm sending you blessings. Please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe to my channel. It is so appreciated. Uh, also, please remember to contact me for a personal session. My email is in the description box down below. Uh, remember to donate for the medicine that you are receiving. Every donation is greatly appreciated and always energetically reciprocated, right? Um, my PayPal is in the description box down below as well. And yeah, thank you so much for joining. Thank you so much for connecting. May the angels carry you on their wings, um, which aren't necessarily like feathery wings, but they might be like locust wings. Ew. But it's still very cool and loving. <laughs> it's so fucking weird. Duality of existence, guys. Um, anyway, I love you. So much love. So many blessings. I can't wait to connect with you again tomorrow. Let's just integrate this energy a little bit more. And make this whole energetic um, exchange that we every day, do every day kind of, um, what's that, what's that word, self-sustaining, yes. To make this whole thing self-sustaining by the power of creator, by the grace of God, in the name of the Christ, indeed. Okay, Satnam, I love you, bye. <laughs>